Hey friends, Dr. Francesco LeBlanc here, doctor of natural medicine and founder of DrBusyMom.com. Today I wanna to share with you one of my family-friendly recipes. It is a dessert, and I like to call it my chocolate happiness pudding, and I know it sounds a little bit silly, but the reason why I call it that is that there are several ingredients in this pudding that are proven to elevate your mood, improve the quality of your sleep, and so on and so on. Let's get right down to it. The main star of the show is an avocado, Sounds weird, right? If you've got small organic avocados at the store this week, go ahead and use two, but these are kind of large, so I'm gonna go ahead and just use one large organic avocado. If you didn't know this already, the main reason why avocados are a superfood is that they are loaded with mono, unsaturated fatty acids. This is gonna support the cardiovascular system. It's gonna help us prevent cancer. It's gonna help us lose weight balance our hormones, so on and so forth. It is a superfood in itself. So if we're not getting avocado into our systems once a day, please, please try this recipe tonight, make this pudding and start making avocado a part of the daily routine. Next up is another superfood. This is raw cacao powder. You're gonna need about a quarter cup. And this is before chocolate, right? Before chocolate comes cocoa, before cocoa comes cacao. Cacao is right from the plant. It is loaded with fiber and trace minerals. We're talking about all of this balancing hormone goodness right here in this raw cacao powder. If it's something you really can't get used to, start out small. Start putting a teaspoon in a smoothie so that you can get used to the taste because it is a little bitter and we do wanna make this so that it's family friendly, we've gotta sweeten it up, right? That's the key to it. So what I like to do is take two pitted dates and soak them in enough filtered water, meaning not a whole glass, but just enough filtered water to cover two dates. And then I add a teaspoon of fair trade organic vanilla extract. Use the good stuff. Don't waste your time with imitation vanilla here. That's gonna put chemicals in the pudding that we don't want. And once we soak the dates for a couple hours before or even overnight, whatever you have, this is what's gonna en enable the dates to swell and blend really smoothly into the pudding. Um, next, I gotta do a little Combo. I really like the way dates and maple syrup taste together and because these are both natural sugars They're not going to be inflammatory like the white stuff and like some other sugars that we know we can buy in the store So I go ahead and use a tablespoon of organic maple syrup there. It really does cut the bitterness of the cacao You'll see for yourself when you make this and then of course we can't do a pudding without a liquid and I like using three quarters of a cup of milkadamia. It's my new favorite nut milk and um, you could use almond milk or whatever nut milk you like and if you don't do nuts at all go ahead and do filtered water it would work the same um, but I really like that we can add some benefit again macadamia nuts are rich in really good fats so if we can build on that and put some more good fat in the body this makes it an even more powerful beneficial dessert so let's go ahead and end with one of my favorite ingredients in the kitchen it is pink Himalayan sea salt I always add salt to desserts that I make and bake, especially chocolate. I find that salt brings out the other flavors and would counteract any over sweetness. So, you know, I ditched white table salt years ago. If you are a mom and you're not in our mom's only private community, you need to get on in there because we really dove into why table salt should be left on a table in a restaurant and never in the house in our cooking and in our bodies. Pink Himalayan say salt really comes from the ocean so it's not only 80% sodium but 20% of trace minerals that are going to help our brain produce happy chemicals like serotonin help our brain produce melatonin so that we can have a restful night's sleep so I really feel strongly about putting at least a little bit of pink Himalayan sea salt into something we eat once a day then go ahead and take all of your ingredients right and put it in your high-speed blender you know I love the ninja just because it is budget friendly and it works really well for me if you've got something else great and then what you get is this unbelievably creamy and delicious pudding like you're not even gonna believe that that's the consistency and you guys, it is so good. Please, if you like this video, I would be so honored if you shared it with your friends. Please, support me on my mission. I'm on a mission to raise healthy families. I don't think it should be confusing, overwhelming, or expensive. And if you share in that, I would be honored if you got people to jump on board. 
Hey, thank you so much for watching. More family-friendly recipes can be found on my Instagram, dr.busymom.com. And if you know somebody that's actually not on social media that would benefit from this, please send them over to my website, www.drbusymom.com and have them sign up for email updates. You guys have a great day. I cannot wait to hear when you try this recipe.